Clay from Orium here. Today, I'm going to show you just how easy it is in a no-code way to merchandise products and make content changes using Orium's Commerce Tools Accelerator. So as you may recall, this is the accelerated web experience. This is out of, kind of out of the box accelerator with our theming and our product set added to it. Uh, and as you may recall, also, it's a multi-branded experience with both Splash and Manifold being controlled by the same content stack, Algolia, and Commerce Tools instances. So let's say we've gotten the directive that we're going to put Sparkling Wines on sale. We're doing a big champagne special. So let's head over into Content Stack. This is our asset list, and I'll just make this thumbnail so it's easier to see. And we'll bring in our new banner image here and behind my head, but it is now completed. And on the Splash homepage, so the content items here in Content Stack correspond to each of the rows on the homepage. And we'll just go ahead and create a new entry. And I'll do this in real time. Create a new full banner. And now use that new image that I've just uploaded. And we can have a different image for mobile as well as for desktop. We can also have different images per locale. I'm just going to do the United States English instance for right now. The eyebrow. And the internal title. Sparkling Special 2023, uh, the banner title, start the day off right, and little content block, champagnes and sparkling wines at a special price. Uh, we're not going to need a call to action button on here because we're going to also have the products on the homepage. Use the dark theme, center the text because that's what we have in the existing banner, and we'll do the same Excel size. So it fits in with the splash look and feel. Go ahead and save this. And then we can bring that up to the top of the page. And I'll publish this change. So this does take a moment to update the cache. But uh, as you saw on the published page, we can also schedule this publication for a future time and date. So we can make all the homepage changes that we require, preview it in real time, and then schedule that to go live at a certain date so that we don't need to be you know, up waiting at midnight to make the changes. And then we can also schedule a reversion back to the previous version because Content Stack uses this great versioning system for controlling the, the different assets in your environment. So let's head over to the Splash page and see what the new banner looks like. And as you can see, we now have the new banner on the home page. It's kind of fun, plays in the playful theme that uh, Splash is going for. So now we need to merchandise some products. We have a Commerce Tools Connector, the same one that we're using for the existing galleries. And we'll make a new one to merchandise products right here on the Splash homepage. So we use the same title, call to action, simple shop now. Just head to the wine section. So now we can scroll through and see all of the products in the Commerce Tools store. However, there are 96 of them. So what I'm going to do instead is use another tool that's been integrated into this environment, Algolia. It's automatically receiving a sync of all of the products from Commerce Tools, and every update and change to those is pushed to Algolia programmatically. So as you can see, we have all of the products that are available for sale in Splash listed here. So we'll just do sparkling wines, and with a click, now I can see only the relevant products. So I'll use this to select products for this promotion. Certainly, we want some champagne. Stuyvesant, saint Germain, And let's get some other sparkling wines. Not going to try to pronounce them all, but uh, one more. And the Delamont Brut. Great. So we added those products, uh, which are all listed here, commerce tools. But now they are available through Content Stack as well. We'll pick the same container size of Excel. Don't need to worry about margin or tags. And we'll save and publish this component. Oh, and we'll want this to be right up at the top as well. So were we really merchandising this on a live experience, we might want to move the existing banner down or take it off of the page for a few days. Choice is yours. but. As you can see, just in a few moments, the new products that we are highlighting for this are 
available right here on the home page. Now, the final piece uh, is going to be adding a discount to have all of these actually at a special price. So I've gone ahead and pre-written the discount logic using Commerce Tools. Uh, they have a really robust discounting tool, a ton of options and tons of flexibility can really reach into uh, a very diverse catalog and select exactly the products or exactly the cart makeup that's appropriate. Uh, in this case, it's pretty straightforward though. I've just made a sparkling special and it applies to all of the wines that have a classification of sparkling wine. So I can save this and again, schedule this to go live at a certain date and time. And once the promotion is live, once the changes have been made and everything's been cycled to Algolia as well, then the promo is ready to go. I was able to do all of that with no code, no developer input, and I have a, a great looking refreshed experience that's ready to push live and delight my customers. Thanks very much and look forward to seeing you in the next one.